What's going on, guys? It's the boy Adoptionism, and it is the weekly ritual day. I know I'm uh, a few hours late on this, but I didn't want to overwhelm you guys with uh, my morning uh, upload that I had scheduled with the uh, Dragon Age video, so I wanted to wait till around lunchtime for me, at least. Uh, and yeah, so uh, we're going to go check out what Zer has to offer, and if he's going to be a complete scrub like he was last weekend, that would really suck if he has uh, Void Fangs. I would actually probably just end the video or laugh and then end the video on that part but i'm not good at I, I don't know we'll find out so uh yeah of course he's right here i swear i think he's in this spot more than he is any other spot but oh shit there we go. holy crap okay finally something new um all right so we got the helm of inmost light which is probably the most badass uh titan uh, exotic for those of you who are the uh, striker builds, because it, when it gives you two of the perks for uh, a move, I mean, that's really freaking sweet, because that means that you can have a third. I believe, Actually, no, I think a Death from Above is from a different slot, or it's Headstrong. No, I think it's Headstrong. It's a different slot. But um, regardless, it's still really awesome to have like that double whammy of, a, of an effect right there. So in my opinion, that's actually probably like my favorite piece of, uh, of Titan gear. Now, uh, for Hunters, they have a Young uh, um, uh, cars, uh, cars Spine, which is uh, the arm thingy that lets you uh, throw your trip mines, and they last a little longer, so that's pretty cool. Uh, but again, they don't last until they detonate or until you die. They just last, like, I think it's like 5 seconds, maybe 10 seconds longer. It, no, I wouldn't say 10 seconds, maybe like 5 seconds. Uh, but it's not, in my opinion, it's, not, it's really not that great. Oh, excuse me. And then for or Warlocks, yes, we have Light Beyond Nemesis, which is really cool. Um, I mean, it's cool. It's it's just like uh, the, what is it? The Lucky Raspberry for the Hunter. And I want to say Armamentarium. It might be uh, Helm of Saint-14 for Titans, but it's the revive your teammates faster and you spawn more orbs. And then, of course, uh, replenish health when you pick up an orb. So that could be really helpful if you have... Um, a full squad that's just alternating supers when you're running through nightmare or nightmare nightfall or anything like that it's really cool and plus again it's really nice to actually see something different for warlocks and also with all of these uh, updates coming out um oh well, obviously we have plan c which was from two weeks ago i believe yeah two weeks uh some of you guys may or may not know about the update that came out you get these exotic shards from dismantling unwanted exotics or you could buy one from Xur for seven strange coins, which if you have three characters, I've, that's le that's less than uh, doing the max difficulty on a Nightfall weekly, so it's really not that big of a deal. So that's really cool. And then, uh, but yeah, I mean, uh, you get those because they made it to where no matter what exotic it is, you can get all the way up. Like, look at this. Look at Spirit Bloom and, and just Glimmer. Like, that is... That is so freaking easy to afford. Oh my god. And it's just that one last piece is the one that you need exotic shards for. And that even that even goes for armor, if you didn't notice on the helmet right here. Got exotic shard and uh, hadronic essence, which is... I mean, it's an armor piece, so I can understand why you have to have those. <sighs> so, in my opinion, uh, if you're a titan and you don't have it, I would say get the helm of inmost light. And if you're a warlock... Uh, again, I mean, usually, uh, skill-wise, whether you're PvE or PvP, uh, <sighs> oh, excuse me, something in the back of my throat, uh, I would say, I mean, I don't think Zer's ever gonna sell, uh, the Heart of Prax or Heart of the Praxic Fire, because that's, I think you could only get that in the raid on hard, I think, I'm not too sure, but yeah, he'll probably never, ever, ever sell that stuff, but, um, yeah, in my opinion, I mean, that. This, Plan C, and the Exotic Shard are the only thing I would get. I mean, we got, of course, we got the Red Tail, we got the Purple Tail, and then Machine Gun, Hand Cannon, and Pulse Rifle Telemetry, which I guess Hand Cannons are good if uh, you're trying to level up your Last Word or your, shit, what was the other one, or Hawk Moon or whatever. I mean, granted, I'm on Xbox One, so we don't have Hawk Moon, you lucky bastards. But, yeah, I mean, that's the only real difference right now, and... 
Uh, I might have it in a link in the description below, or you guys could just look it up yourself. Uh, I, I'm, I don't know. I've been busy today, but uh, Dest or Bungie tweeted out this morning that Granite Zer has that stuff for uh, for the this weekend, but with the DLC coming out on Tuesday, they uh, they in the tweet they said that Zer is here this weekend, but uh, travelers or guardians, or whatever. Uh, be my or keep in mind that next weekend, because that'll obviously be after the raid comes out, that he's gonna. Ha they said I think he's gonna have like way better gear or like super power. I don't know. They pretty much insinuated that he's gonna have like insanely better shit than what he normally has. So I, if anything, if you really are kind of like wanting to test the waters or whatever, I mean, you could get the stuff now. But honestly, with them saying that, I. I'd go for the gamble, and if anything, I might buy like one or two exotic shards. But then after that, I mean, I definitely I'd hold off everything until next weekend. But yeah, guys, really hope you liked my opinion and uh, helped uh, curve your guys' views on some of this stuff. And until next time, this has been your boy Adopt. Thanks for watching. Please don't forget to leave a like, comment, subscribe. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter at Adoptionism. Link is down in the description below. And as always, don't forget to check out my buddy Jay's stream. All of his stuff or all of his links are down in the description as well. And of course, don't forget to stop by 7controllers.com. Use discount code Adopt. That's A D O P T. Uh, upon your checkout to get 5% off anything. It would help me out, uh, and it's also a way that I can help you guys out by making stuff cheaper. So yeah, guys, thanks for watching. This has been Adopt. Peace out.